What up guys, welcome to another video. Today we're gonna to react to Basi, M Touch, Ranger, Amaza. It's the song called Quelanga 2.0 and it's featuring T-Man Express and Lee Mac Crazy. We're gonna jump right in, react to this one. Let's go. Because for me, I understand. I don't understand what she's saying. Of course, I don't know the 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 story she's telling or whatever. But for me, this right here, I don't know why. It just looks. The fact that they just decided, you know what? Pause it here and just zoom in. Some dramatic Bollywood, a uh, Bollywood movie. Some some real Bollywood movie directing right there. You just gotta. I mean, <laughs> it's funny, but let's keep on. Going. I always look at things at a comedic way, like a comedic sense, so don't get pissed at me. I'm just finding it funny. Like she could have been alone right there. Like she could have, this scene could have been her just being there alone, just singing, you know? Why the fuck did auntie just come out? Looked at her like, this bitch crazy. She talking to herself. Who brought this? Take her out right now. You talking to yourself, sister? Damn, you don't, nah, what the fuck? I don't, I don't know why I'm working at this hospital. <laughs> <laughs> Look at her <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Some of you guys are probably thinking, why the fuck is this guy reacting to a music video and then making everything about comedy right now? But look at the face she's making. Like, y'all ain't paying me enough for this dumb shit right now. <laughs> y'all ain't paying me enough for this dumb shit that... Is she talking to herself right now? Is she? Who is she talking to? There is no camera in front of me. <laughs> Imagine if this was reality and she's just like sitting there in the, on that wheelchair and just fucking yapping on. And then you got you got auntie coming out. Like, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> I really really wonder 
<clears throat> I really, really wonder what this is about, what the song is about. Because I might be like, some of you guys probably thinking, man, this is a deep song. What a deep meaning. What a, like a, what a beautiful song or whatever. And I'm here just laughing at the music video. Like, <laughs> I'm, so, I'm sorry if I, like, I, did, I, I hope I did not offend anyone. I hope you guys laugh with me. Because I just wanted to, you know, highlight those parts where I thought was, you know, pretty funny because of it's the director's, I would say it's the director's fault, okay? Don't hate on me, okay? If you guys are hating on me, you guys are bugging, okay? Like, just the mere fact that she's, you know, she's right here, singing. And then auntie just came out of nowhere, bro. Now I'm going to just head on my, I'm just heading... I'm just gonna get the fuck out of here, okay? <laughs> nah, seriously, come on now. D come on. D of course it's gonna be fun. But uh, I feel like the song, let's get serious right now. I feel like the song has such a, uh, a unique, uh, not a unique sound, but the beat is really good. The beat is really good. Uh, Lee My Crazy, I feel, did a great job. As per usual, I really like Lee My Crazy. Uh, for me, as I said, I feel like he is the number one I'm a piano artist in the world. Uh, and then this guy right here, I don't know who he is, uh, but I would guess it's T-Man Express. Uh, but T-Man Express, man, this guy right here, now this is the wrong frame to have. Uh, so I'm gonna try to find a better frame because holy shit, I'm doing him dirty with this frame. Uh, but uh, let's uh, let's find. Okay, this is even worse. Uh, let's find a better frame. This one, is right here. this one right here. Let's keep it right there. Uh, yeah, T Man Express. I found like the moment he he his verse started, I was like, oh shit. Okay, now we taking the energy up. But I don't know what they're singing about, so I'm probably fucking you know getting hyped up for no reason. The same way I got hyped up for. Um, what's his name? No, 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 no. I, I, I'm so shit at names, bro. Yeah, the song was called Fikan, Future and Rema, okay? B BNXN made a song with Rema called Fikan. And on that one, it was some serious shit. Like, he was singing about, like, some somebody owning him money and stuff like that. And I'm, I'm just there like vibing to the beat and shit like that. And I did not understand what the fuck was being like, what the fuck the whole, you know, storyline was about it on that song. So everybody was like, bro, do you even know what the fuck they're talking about? And I was like, nah. So uh, yeah, I feel like th this is going to be like the same shit, like the same story. But either way, as I said, I really liked the song. I really liked her. Um, the 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 woman that was singing on this uh, the song i don't know who she is what her name is maybe it's probably amaza but i don't know I, i'm not 100 percent sure you guys can tell me in the comment section below but i really liked her vocals i really liked her the 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 chorus that she was singing was really nice uh but everybody they they did their thing they did their thing with this one uh, and i liked it i liked it for sure with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this reaction video. If you did, hit that like button down below. Subscribe so you don't miss out on future videos. And uh, yeah, make sure to go and follow me on Twitch. Uh, the link is in the description. Make sure to follow me on the other social media platforms if you want to stay up to date or, you know, get some updates. I I'm probably going to share stuff or whatever. Um, and uh, yeah, it could be a great idea to follow me on those platforms as well. But with that being said, take care, God bless, and deuces.